Hello, welcome back. So today we're gonna take you guys to the LA Zoo. They just reopened. I'm not quite sure what it's gonna look like when we get there, um, but you do have to make reservations. So we made reservations. Um, they have a ton, a ton of different time slots. So we have a two o'clock, it's currently 1.15, but we did stop by um, a Mediterranean restaurant. We had placed an order, so we're gonna grab that for lunch. And there's our food. Aiden, where are we going? Uh, to the zoo. 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 Oh, yeah. Let's go to the zoo. Hey. <laughs> All right, kids are going to eat sota from Burbank before we have to go into the zoo. Right, baby? Yeah. You're gonna eat? Yay! Go check it out. I don't know how it. There's a line over there. There's an entrance here, but you have to have a reservation. So let's see. Yes. Oh, okay. Thank you. No, once you're in, you can safely close at five o'clock. <clears throat> so this is a line for this is a line to enter at two. I thought they were gonna say like you only have a certain amount of time to be here. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It's warm. <laughs> All right, first. Animal we see is a seal. That was easy. They just scanned the pictures I took of the tickets and took a minute. That was it. Yeah, we're gonna go see them right now. Let's go. Say bye to the seal. See you later. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. So we asked if there was a time limit. They said no, that we can be here until they close at five. But they still have like the reservations are all by time slot. So I don't know. I don't know what the difference is. I think it's just like being able to control how many people come in. But yeah, we're inside. We already saw a seal and now I don't know what we're gonna see next, but we'll see. Everyone has their masks on. And yeah, let's see what's next. Can you see it? It's an alligator. Do you see it? Can you see it? Yeah, I can see it. Mom, there's a camp lock. You want to get up? Wow. Yeah, let him see. That's so cool, huh, baby? Yay, we have flamingos over there. There's this girl literally walking around with a white claw. I did not know that you could walk around with alcohol in your hands here. Look, baby, look at the flamingos over there. Look. Wow. I think he's scared. Come here. Wow, look at them. They're so pretty. Aiden. Wow. Look at them, baby. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah! Aiden. Look, Aiden, there's more over here. Look, some more. Let's go find more animals. Come on. All right, let's go. You want to go see your brother, Aiden? <laughs> I'm going to leave you with the gorillas, okay? Why? Because. There's this girl walking around with a white collar in her hand. Yeah. I didn't know you could do that. What's up? Well, I know, but she like was at the entrance with a white collar and I didn't know that. <laughs> That's so interesting. We're looking for the gorillas and I think we found them. I have my little monkey here. And I think, I think the gorillas are over here. Yeah. There's another one over there. I don't see it. Aiden, come here. Oh, there she is. Look, baby. Look, Papa. Look over there. Look over there. Look at the monkeys. Oh, she's a baby. Mom. Oh my God, I don't think you can see Mom. it. Mom. Yes. Oh, oh, yes, oh, oh, monkey, oh, oh. oh they have a little baby. They have a baby. <laughs> Mom. Yes. Babe, how are you feeling it? How are you liking it? It kind of feels the same as before, right? First time going out. Yeah, that's true. We haven't really taken Isaac out a lot. Because this whole thing happened when we were ready to take him out. I'm right here! But it kind of feels like like normal. Like just people wearing their masks and trying to stay apart from each other, which is kind of hard with kids. We've literally only seen the flamingos, alligator, and... The gorilla. Giraffes. Yes, baby. Just let the people get out there and then we'll see the map. Okay? But look, look at the giraffes. You're missing them. Mama, it looks like they're hugging. It looks like they're hugging? Oh, there's a little one. Where's the little one? Stand up. You see it? Over there. Huh? Over there. Yeah. Oh, right there. That's a little one. There's a little baby one uh, right he here. Right? Yeah. Oh, let's go see the map. Where we are. The country. Uh, the country? Yeah. <laughs> he wants to see the map where the animals are. Look, babe, come over here on this side, babe. No, don't, don't. Stand up. I just saw one right, yeah, right there. Right there. Yeah. Yeah, he's eating. Oh, Papa, he said he likes your mask. Say thank you. He's very shy. Thank you. <laughs> okay, Say thank you. Hi, boy. <gasps> wow. Yeah. <Okay. gasps> yeah. Never 
see an elephant when we come. Like, oh, yeah. Hey, we're me and Annie came. Me, me and Annie came one time, but he was bathing. Really? I feel like Mom. whenever. Yes. Remember? You were touching okay. my hair. Oh, you want to touch my hair? Oh yeah, you remember? Mhm. Mm yeah. You want to do it like this? Okay. Ooh, you don't want to grab me like. Okay, we're done. We're out of here. Just got them some toys. Dad got them some toys. It's kind of hot, you guys. It's really windy and breezy and cool under the shade, but... Other than that, it's kind of warm. I'm literally just sweating. It's really warm today. It's sunny. I was trying to set you guys up here, but I can't. I'm just gonna hold you guys. But a couple of things that I would say about the, you know, the experience at the LA Zoo is, if you're uncomfortable, like taking your mask off around people, I would say definitely make sure you feed the kids yourself um, and bring snacks. Like eat before you get there because the eating areas they do have them open and people are there you know no nobody's wearing their masks while they're eating and stuff so we went and we got food we fed the kids in the car before we went and of course I took them snacks I took them like I have like a cup I couldn't find a like a container so I have like a cup of like cut up strawberries I took a couple of the Welch's like the little fruit snacks um I brought pretzels just in case, waters. I had like the little honest apple juices, so I brought them some of those. We weren't there very long. We didn't go to like every single thing. Now a lot of them are, the exhibits are closed. Like I think like the lions were closed. Um, the reptiles area is closed and that, I'm imagining that that's because it's like indoors. If you guys have ever been to the LA Zoo, it's. Um, the reptile section is like you have to go through like a little cave looking thing So that was all closed um, But I'm glad that like the kids really liked the gorillas the chimpanzees the orangutans We didn't go in there because again, there was just a lot of people um, But we noticed that there was a lot of people were like in the eating area near the giraffes if you've ever been to LA Zoo, you know exactly what I'm talking about um, that was like pretty crowded. That was probably the most congested area we walked through. And then I would say that would that was really the most congested. But again, that's, those are just like my tips is like eat before you go if you feel uncomfortable. My little guy, he did not last with the mask. So he was without the mask most of the time. Aiden, he had his most of the time unless he was like eating or I'm not eating. drinking. I'm not no, baby, eating. when when you were eating snacks at the zoo. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> so other than that, though, um, not too bad. It was really warm and the sun was really harsh. So that's why we're like we just couldn't do the whole thing. Um, and then a lot of uphills. We took this little wagon. But oh my god, with both of the kids in there and just like going uphill, it was pretty hard. Luckily, I'm such a blessed woman that my man just like, he was like taking care of the wagon and stuff. But yeah, other than that, I mean, I really liked it. It just felt like normal. Um, I think they only do reservations just to kind of control the incoming traffic. Um, 
like I said, it didn't feel too crowded in some areas, but very crowded in others. So just keep that in mind. They did have the gift shop open. If you guys have ever been there, they usually have two, um, but they only had one. Like when you walk in on your right hand side, you'll see one there. And of course it's controlled how you walk through the store and stuff. Um, what else did we see that was kind of different? I mean, obviously there's signs everywhere. They still have benches where you can sit down, eat, eat snacks and stuff. Um, they have like all of the little food things. If you've ever been there, they have like a little ice cream kiosk thing that's still open. The churros still open. We honestly didn't want to wait because there was people like around that area not wearing masks. And then again, the sun was pretty like harsh so we didn't want to just like be standing in line and waiting there for the churros and ice cream so yeah that was pretty much it but i think the kids really enjoyed it we enjoyed it it was nice to finally have something to do with the kids um because obviously like there's there's not much like we can go to the park we don't allow our kids to play in the on the playgrounds just because like what are we gonna do wipe them down before the kids play with them like no so other than that though it was really good um i felt like everyone was really you know the keeping their masks on obviously there's times where you're literally right next to other people um and i think that's just mainly because you go with kids and kids you know they just kind of run wild and stuff and they want to talk to other little kids and stuff and one thing I will say that's really sad to me is like one little boy yeah, came and told my son like, oh, I like your mask. Yeah, and my son just kind of like walked you away. Me, Aiden. That's and I, that's and I feel like that's just kind of like the social my mom issues my that I'm seeing with like my kid. And that's just because he doesn't get to socialize with other kids, which makes me really sad. But I'm glad they got to see other faces. But yeah, you guys, that was it. That was our LA Zoo trip for the day. So I will catch you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.